Experiment 3. Compounds of calcium, water hardness, and salt content of water, chemicals and apparatus. Silver nitrate, phenolphthalein, three tenths smaller hydrochloric acid, standard sodium hydroxide, Erlenmeyer, burette, test tube and tube rack, ion exchange column. Determination of salt content of tap water. In this procedure, the liquid level should not drop below 3 cm above the top of the column. Washing the resin. Add 25 ml of hydrochloric solution into the resin column. Place a clean island mayor under the tip of the column. Loosen the clamp and allow hydrochloric solution pass through the column. The flow of solution should not be faster than 5 ml per minute. Then wash the column with distilled water to remove chlorine ions. Collect a few drops of water from bread in a test tube and add two or three drops of silver nitrate solution. Any cloudiness indicates chlorine ion. Columns should be washed until cloudiness disappears. When no chlorine ion remains, the resin is ready to use. Use of ion exchange column. Pour 50 ml of tap water sample into the column. Loosen the clamp and allow the water to pass through the column. When nearly all of the tap water is flown into the column, add 50 ml of distilled water to the column. Loosen the clamp and allow distilled water to pass through the column.
When nearly all of the distilled water has flown into the column, add another 25 milliliters of distilled water to the column. This should wash the remaining tap water into the Erlenmeyer. Titration of effluent with standard sodium hydroxide solution. Add a few drops of phenylphthalein indicator to the solution collected from the column. Titrate this solution with 10 molar sodium hydroxide. Continue to titrate until color of the solution turns into pink.